Hi guys, welcome to my speed test on the iPod Touch 2nd generation and the iPod Touch 4th generation. What I'm guessing a lot of iPod Touch users will, users will be doing is buying in the generation every two years. That's what I did. Um, so I thought I'd give you a little comparison on both devices. Now the 4th generation is on the right and the 2nd generation is on the left. So these devices are both off, and now we're going to do an on test, turn them on, so, ready, there we go. As you can tell, my second generation is jailbroken, that's why I've got the cool background. I'll give you some specs. The second generation has 533 MHz with 228 MB of RAM, while the fourth generation has a 1 GHz Apple A4 chip with 256 MB of RAM, so that's double the speed on both RAM and processing speed. Although the iPhone 4 has 512 MB of RAM, which is double. There we go, the fourth generation easily won in that one, while the second generation is still loading. There we go. Right, so both devices are now on. We will see even, even how, even when unlocking the devices, it still, it still takes longer. The first test will be on music. So the music app is here. Okay, three, two, one. The next test will be on maps, so I'm going to turn these both on at the same time. Look at how the fourth generation easily beating it. Remember these are both on Wi-Fi, on the same Wi-Fi routers. The next test will be a game and it's going to be rail racing, so we're going to find the game, here we go, put it into landscape mode now. Okay, the first started. So if that looks very even, but obviously the fourth generation has a better processor and RAM. There we go, that's already started. There we go. Next one we be will be Tap Tap Revenge. Now Tap Tap Revenge I have modded on my second generation, but that doesn't mean it's gonna be slower. Again the fourth generation beat it there. But in the fourth generation it got ads. <laughs> okay. A lot of people use iPods for communication, so the next one I will do Twitter, or Echo font in this case. Look at that, first gen second generation, very slow in this. Also I've got to say that the second generation iPod Touch on iOS 4 has problems with Wi-Fi inconsistency with it and it's dropping it every so often and it's just dropped now actually so not good at all we'll put that into minimize for the moment okay the next test will be safari okay we're gonna um end gadget test will be now wow fourth generation easily beat that ah that was clever. Well, that didn't go too well, did it? You know what? We'll start that one again. Oh, well, even though, to be honest, the fourth generation's beating it, even though it's loaded two websites. And the fourth generation's finished, and the second generation's still going. I 
Now we're going to do Crunch Gear, the um, tech website from TechCrunch. Fourth generation, nearly finished now. There we go, it's started. Second generation is still going. There we go, now it's finished. Now we're going to do some scrolling, so. Ready? Woo! See how the second generation's had it's taken a while to look keep up. See how it goes all greyish. See like that. While well, the fourth generation just doesn't do that at all. So thanks for watching my second gen v fourth gen speed test. I hope you watch my my videos and thanks for watching. Thanks. Bye.